Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for stopping by. So today's video is an exciting one. Literally, I'm filming this at the middle of the night. I have no makeup on, my hair's frizzy. I was not expecting to film this video. Basically, I'm currently visiting family and one of my cousins is a collector. I think that's an understatement because if you guys don't follow me on Instagram at himaka underscore zero zero, you would have seen his figurine collection, which is, it is top tier. <laughs> Top tier is even an understatement for him because it is mad. Anyway, today's video, I am rating my cousin's manga collection. I haven't really looked too deep in what he has and I thought it would be fun to share with you guys like his collection and see some series that we never really see in the community because it's literally out of print and he basically owns it. So why not? So before we get into this video, please give this video a like, comment, subscribe, you know the drill, and click on the bell. And feel free to use my affiliate links down below for Blackwell's, Amazon, and Right Stuff to help support this channel and its future giveaways. But yeah, before I start showing you guys his mind collection and start rating it, I want to show you guys what he has in this room. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, like I mentioned earlier, you guys would have seen the behind the scenes of his other stuff that he has. And it is just wow. So I thought it would be nice to show you guys a little clip of my cousin's figurine collection. This is just one of his rooms that he has that is filled with figurines. He does own quite a few manga series, but I'm not too sure where he has put them. But you can see he recently picked up a Chainsaw Man. This is actually hard to get. And then also Gantz 26. This is volume 26 wow and then at the back he has some series that i really would like to pick up <laughs> but they're super hard to get so several lovely this is a recent series that everyone's been on the hype train on um blue period is this one as well so this is bride story i heard a lot of things about that as well so on this side he has holy corpse rising i feel like he bought a library copy i wonder if this is hard to get series um then monster volume one which i've always wanted to get but it's out of stock but i heard recently they have been doing some reprints and there's court party vagabond one you guys know how hard it is to get a vagabond nowadays but yeah he has a lot of manga series but i'm not too sure where he has put them but and over on this side he has some creepy looking ones like predator 2 if you can see up there but yeah this is the scariest one in my opinion but um, yeah, he has loads of lovely figurines. This is just one of his rooms. At top, he has more as well. These, like you can tell, they are automatic when you go near them. But he has some figurines there as well. And he has a lot of um, games. And it looks like he is a movie collector. He has lots of steel books and some other movies as well. Basically, when I was in his home, I didn't know where his manga collection was. I was thinking, did he sell all his collection? But it turns out, this was the hidden gem. He put it all here because there was literally no room in the house. And um, I, 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 I just can't believe I'm sat next to some of these series because it's mad. Anyway, let me just pick up my tripod and start showing you guys this room. Um... I guess this would be his storage room because all his other figurines are currently in display at home. But this is, um, let me just show you the overview because, wow, I, uh, <laughs> I'm gobsmacked. If you see my Instagram story, you know I was so lost for words. I'm still lost for words, to be honest, with his collection. Like, this is just crazy. So, this is my collection right here. And he does have a few boxes filled with manga. Um, a lot of his manga he did mention earlier to me that he did sell them. So like sample Love Hina. But I did see a volume of Love Hina. Like here, yeah, I see volume one. So what he said, he does pick a lot of his manga on eBay. And um, he does pick up a lot of volume ones and see if he enjoys the series and pick up the rest. But I'm telling you, there's so many rare series that I'm seeing right here. And th this this is just mad. I this is just goals. I I'm, and I don't think I can ever achieve this in my lifetime. But we're still gonna rate it. We're still gonna share it. Cause what in the world am I seeing here? Do, can you see this eye shield? This is such a out of print series, <laughs> and it's complete. 
Wow, um, I think I might help him organize some of his collection as well as um, a lot of the volumes, he does have all the volumes, but it's just not in order. So I might help him with that as he said he didn't mind, but I only have like an hour or two left of here before I start leaving to go home as we live very, very far away. He did say that I can borrow some of his series, but I, I can never do that to someone's collection, you know? And even like, if I did say yes, I, I can't guarantee I will bring that series back in a year or so. As I haven't seen my cousin properly for two years, let alone have a sit down chat, you know? So you know what I'm saying, but it's lovely that he did say that is okay. But he is a cultured man, okay? I'm gonna have to mention that he used to have a lot of great coach and manga but i did ask him about that and he did say he did sell a lot so um that's unfortunate that i won't be able to show you that many but there should be quite a few isekai series lying about um please excuse the mess because this was not planned at all but yeah let's just start the video first off i want to mention is this berserk statue because what the blimming heck this is wow this is 20 out of 10 if i can rate it higher i'll say a thousand out of ten because what in the world all that detail if you can see is absolutely stunning and um yeah he is a big figurine collector this is not even one percent of the collection so um yeah we'll just we'll, oh i see some culture stuff at the top wow we okay we're just gonna leave it as that but um oh maybe some culture down here as well but yeah, so this is his manga collection. So I will go through some of the boxes depending if I have enough time. So there's one, two, oh, I see Attack and Titan, the Colossal Editions. My man, oh, he has this initial D. Wow, okay, this is, you're lying. He has, he has my hero. This is, this is madness. Already you can tell my reaction is just, I'm just so gobsmacked. Um, but yeah, he has some figurines at the top as well. So this is the first row of the series. So I see some berserk Akira. Oh my lord, he has battle royale. I'm so sorry. This video is literally so ratchet, but this is literally my live reaction of his manga collection. But um, yeah, you guys are reacting with me basically. But yeah, I hope you guys will enjoy this video as this is pure genuineness. Like I did not plan this before. You're lying, he has GTO, that's mad. I know Kate Tins' manga is missing a few volumes of this series um, in her collection. He did mention this was his first ever manga series that he collected. Um, he has Toriko, Dead Man Wonderland, Food Wars, oh wow. Okay, so I'm gonna start reacting to the shells very soon. I just wanna give you guys a full on overview of what he has so you guys can look as well i feel like i'm doing a manga shopping with me this is absolutely crazy so please don't mind the mess down here he did say this is um a bit of culture and manga i think i think this is an isekai maybe katen's manga would know about the series but yeah there's some other series that will look oh he has the promised neverland oh no he just has volume one okay so yeah I'm, i'll start reacting now and put you guys down and maybe organize this collection bit a bit but right now you can hear from the audio i i i, I am just gobsmacked <laughs> like, i can't believe currently i just feel like i am dreaming like can you see i'm sweating because this does not feel real what the what you probably never see me react like this ever in my youtube videos because normally i'm a bit more chilled but right now i don't think i can keep cool with all this and i don't think you guys would either i feel like behind the video you guys will be like oh my god Tiff, this <coughs> i'm shaking on myself right now jeez i feel like you guys will be reacting with me thinking Whoa. like you guys are gassed because this i am gassed i am calm calm the even the even more gas thing is that my cousin said the other day he did go on youtube and my video popped up in his like recommendations that is so th that's so weird <laughs> i did feel a bit awkward but it's nice hearing that oh my video is getting out there somehow but yeah i'm just gonna start from top to bottom but one thing i've noticed he has one punch man figurine and some sword wow he has naruto okay i've just noticed what the figurines were at the top so it looks like this row is naruto figurines and the top a mixture so i think that's a sword art online character bleach one punch man and some more naruto but wow 
just wow i don't know how to even compliment what's happening because this does not feel real like let's just look at this once more okay let's start let's start reacting because i feel like i'm already reacting to be honest but i'm gonna go from line by line and start looking at the manga and going into the nitty gritty as he did say all these manga are double stacked so um yeah let, let's get to it one thing i do want to mention although i'm a manga collector i won't have all the knowledge of all the manga series on here a lot of them i will know that they're out of print or they're popular but since i haven't read the series i wouldn't know what the story is about so just bear in mind i'm literally a manga noob compared to my cousin because wow anyway let's start with the first shelf so the first shelf we see is Berserk. He looks like he has the deluxe editions, but he does have all the volumes of Berserk published in English, which is crazy. But um, yeah, let's look at this. So he has volume two of the deluxe editions. All of it is still in wrapped, except from this one, which is volume one. So he has volume one, five, four, seven, and two. That's really nice. I feel like these volumes are super expensive to pick up. So yeah that's it's nice seeing that he does have the deluxe editions not just the singles personally i love the singles how they look is just amazing then he has akura i own this in my collection as i picked up the box set then here he has battle royale i haven't seen these ever in the uk so seeing this here i am I, I just can't comprehend because normally I see Battle Royale, like the big ones from Tokyo Pop that was released back in the day. Normally I see these in other people's collections, but not in people's collections in the UK. So I'm so, so surprised to see this here. It looks absolutely sick. Like, whoa. Anyway, oh, it looks like he has a Yu-Gi-Oh um, figurine. I hope you guys can hear me. I'm a bit short, so I don't know if the mic is picking up the sound. So next we have High School of the Dead. Full colour edition one. Oh, I, d I didn't even know they have colour editions. Wow. So next he has Nosuka of the Valley of the Wind by Hayao Miyazaki. This is a box set that... Oh. Hi. Come in, come in, man. Come in. I'm just reacting at the collection. Do you mind being on camera or you don't want to be uh, on camera? That's not... <laughs> that's not... Uh, I do want me and I actually be in it, but I'll put an emoji on your face. Okay, uh, yeah, yeah. So my brother just came in and uh, whilst I was reacting to the collection... What's your thoughts? Just, just literally, this is just 10 seconds of coming in here. This is insane. Like, amount of manga, but it's insane. In his collection, there's just so many out of print series that he can't even get. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, there's so many, like, like old school prints, like, yeah. What in the world? Yeah, and I, I, I don't know how to react to certain or rate certain series because I haven't read it but I was just going through line by line of what series he has and just talking about it because it's crazy look at that berserk can you, can you, we, we all have to appreciate the berserk statue like yeah, what that's amazing. That's amazing. I, I don't know what this is though what is this is this one piece no this is um ah fairy tale a fairy oh, oh I, get, I always get one piece and fairy tale mixed up but yeah it's crazy. Probably my brother knows more than me. I'm, I'm not as cultured as you can tell in it. But um, yeah, he does have a lot more shonen series. But yeah, let's go back to Nausicaa Wind of the Valley. So this by Hayao Miyazaki. I would love to collect this. Um, it's actually not too expensive. I think you can get this for £30. Next, it looks like Battle Angel Adlita. Never heard of this, so um, I'll just keep it as that. But seeing that it's by Kodansha, seems like a so expensive expensive. So next he has Vagabond. He does have volume one upstairs. I'm guessing he just haven't organized it and put it together. As I have mentioned, a lot of his volumes are jumbled up. So it looks like, I don't know what this is, but I guess these are some art books. Or oh, he has Attack of Titan Junior High. All you need is kill. Or oh, he has, it looks like he has the wolf. Let's see what this is. Yes, he has the wolf children and um yeah you can tell my brother's already straight into gto yeah, this is such like a print, like old this is so out of print i was saying to um uh saying to him like the, um caitlin's been trying to collect this series but mm. she's missing a few volumes so she can't read oh, it that sucks. yeah she has to, like, she has to, like, it's really hard to find yeah, yeah. yeah. anyway yeah the next series is Toriko. Do you know anything about Toriko? 
No, I don't know. Yeah. Nothing about Toriko. All I know is that everyone has been wanting this series. Oh, wow, it's got 42 volumes. He did say it's double stacked, so the back will have more. Yeah, there's more Toriko vo volumes. Oh, wait, this is not... It's double stack, yeah. Hey, that's insane. It's mad in it. Like I said, it, it, like at first you're like thinking, oh wow, God. is the fact that it's double stacked as well. Oh, can you help me put this back? I don't yeah, want to yeah. ruin it. Yeah. Struggles of having one hand holding the camera, but yeah. Next we have is GTO. Like I mentioned, I don't know. Does he have all the volumes of GTO? Because oh, he has volume twenty five. He might actually have it all. I, I think he does have the whole series. Yeah, I'm pretty sure That's he has crazy. Everything. And it's all plastic wrapped. Uh, actually, let's look at the one a condition. They didn't look too bad either. Wow. This is such a nice I mean, surprise. I mean, I mean, even though a lot of these are like, you know, in terms of like manga, they're all like yellowing. Oh, it's, it's not like, bad. It's very like antique when you look at it. Yeah, he was saying that he likes the smell of the manga. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's kind of different. It hits like, even though it's not like fresh manga. Yeah. It's. It's like a collector's edition. Like mm -mm -mm. You still appreciate it and you're still reading. Yeah. I did ask him about his his culture manga, basically. It's actually etchy collection, Peter. I remember he did have an etchy collection. Yeah, yeah. He really, but, he's into like a lot of like genres. Yeah. But Ooh. etchy is like one of his main ones as Jeez, well. Jeez, yeah. he has Vampire Knight. I don't think this guy would read romance series. The fact that he has Vampire Knight, I'm so I surprised. I mean, there's more action Ooh. in that series than can, romance. Can, can, can you put that action in my ass? <laughs> yeah. No, but did you realise the series is so messed up? You know the relationship. In it yeah, yeah, the yeah. Guy. Wait, have yeah. you have you ever watched it? Or yeah, 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 that's yeah, yeah. that is the fact that my brother even watched Vampire Night. That's crazy. Yeah, it's mad. This what was that? What's that single volume on the side? Something else. I don't know what it is. Put pull that out a bit. Like oh, Vampire Night. Oh yeah, it's he's even got book. he's even oh, got a fan book. Yeah. That's crazy. I didn't think I expect him to have that in his collection. This now, this is beautiful. Wait, is this like out of print now? Can it's really. Is it? you can still get it. It's just really hard to get all the volumes. I was gonna say, this is like insane. But it's it's considered out of print in a way. Yeah. It, it really it really depends. Wait, does it annoy you that? Yeah. Not numbered from like one to like web Yeah, but yeah, that's that's, that's what he was jump. saying. I was saying to him, I, I yeah. can help you organize it, but it depends <laughs> if I have time. He's got so much. The thing is, yeah, this is, this is only like a section of his collection. You know? Yeah, look, there's there's more manga here. I was saying in the boxes. Yeah, they're just stacked. It's just stacked. Yeah, this, this is crazy. So like, okay, we, uh, do, do you know what this these series are? What is this one? No, I don't really. I feel like he does pick up some library um, ones though, because yeah. they are, oh, these are very old series, it feels like. Yeah. Oh, I don't want to pull too much. Oh, is that yeah. something? Ooh, oh, 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 that's cultured and that's cultured. Okay, yeah, sorry. We'll censor that. Yeah. We'll censor that. <laughs> I'll, 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 I'll censor your name as well. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. The next sure. series he has is, what's this, what does that say? Siren. 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 Yeah, Siren. Never heard of this. Have you? Yeah, this some of these series I have. I, I'm, this like, too I'm old school for us. <laughs> maybe it could be old school, but like just very hidden genres. Well, yeah. Like, you know. This case closed. This is a surprise to see. You can see yeah. it's a little bit washed out from the coloring, yeah. but um, I'm pretty sure this is complete. The thing is, with my cousin, he uh, he. Uh, I can't even talk. The thing with my cousin, he likes collecting manga that is complete rather than filling up gaps. Yeah, yeah. Um, even though I know it does look jumbled, it's no, most he's likely got, he's got, he's got he's, yeah, he's, he's got, got all of it. All of it. <laughs> Don't worry. worry, we can guarantee that. Yeah. As he, Bleach, he, yeah. yeah. He would even like if there's like a series, like one episode, like sorry, one one manga he's missing, he'll find it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Bleach. It. So and then what? What say so dead, dead? Uh, not dead, dead demon. Sorry, demon Wonderland, Warcraft. I, I, I swear this is a game. I'm pretty yeah, sure yeah. it's a game. But they, I think they did a, like a comic series. That's what it is actually. Oh, yeah, right. This one. So. Yeah, he. Cool. It looks like he has. He's up to date with, Dead Man Wonderland. Actually, I think this is actually a completed series. To be honest, that's mad. I, I'm not. I don't feel like I'm rating these series. I'm just explaining what I feel. How I feel right now. Reacting more like. Yeah. There's food wars. Not a series that um, a lot, actually, ooh, there's 32. I didn't know um, Food Wars was actually that far in, 32 volumes. I did remember Caitlin did say about the last two volumes. Wait, can we just appreciate Slam just dunk. this section, especially this section. We have me. this at home. So I have one to 10, basically. Yeah. 
but I don't have the rest. <laughs> the, wait, does he have the whole s- yeah, series? Yeah, yeah, it goes up, yeah. You're yeah. lying. Yeah. He has the whole, that, That's actually, there's not a surprise. We, we shouldn't be surprised. As we said, he does have all his manga complete. It's just all jumbled up. Yeah, like, look at this series. This series I want to get, but you can't Housing. get this series, yeah. Yeah, Holy now they do it in a deluxe edition like Berserk. Oh, is it deluxe? Yeah. Oh, but it's different, you know what I mean? The, yeah. The, the OG print is actually so much nicer. Yeah. The next thing That's he has is My Hero Academia. Yeah. Haven't read that, haven't watched it, but I don't know. Everyone's hyping about this series. A lot of people with my Instagram do um, ask me if I have read this series, mm. and um, I just have to say, no, I haven't. <laughs> have, you, have you not seen the anime? I haven't seen the anime. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, I've seen the anime, and I haven't read the manga, but I, I quite highly rate it, actually. Yeah. I give it like 8 out of 10, so it's actually a really oh, good series, yeah. Okay, that's my brother's recommendation yeah, then. Yeah, yeah. There's quite a lot of, of like. Um, Individual character development in the mm-hmm. anime, which I like how you really bought figurines up. for it as well and put it together. Yeah. Okay, the next thing we have is Blue Exorcist. Um, I don't know if this is complete, but I know this is a popular series. I have watched the anime, really loved it. Hmm. Do you remember Blue Exorcist? Sort of. It's like two brothers. One of them doesn't have like some demon power, and one does. Yeah, like, yeah. Like, <laughs> grew up into, they grew up in like a Catholic church or something, and then. Some yeah. cra- oh, that, that looks cultured like right that, there. So. But um, it is a good series, I remember. Yeah. It was, but this was like four, four or five years ago or something like that. Yeah, so. it's been a while. Yeah. Then he has Soul Eater. This is the same manga as Fire Force. I do own Fire Force, but I'm just not up to date. And yeah, yeah, he pretty much... I should stop taking all these volumes out, actually, because I feel like yeah, it's just hard to... Yeah. He has Royal oh, Ruin and Kenshin. Wow. Yeah, Normally you see these in omnibuses nowadays. So I'm not going to take these out of the back because most likely it's going to be the other volumes of Rooney Kenshin. PhD, never heard of this. What's this? Fantasy degree. Okay, we'll just let me know down below in the comment section if you've read this or... Oh, God, I feel like I'm going to bring... <laughs> so many boxes in here. Yeah. And stuff. It's just like... Bakuman. Like, yeah. He's got so much to the point where like you can't even like stack them or like put them on display. Yeah, you can like, This is like just... A section of it. Yeah. It's, like... it's the fact that the main house doesn't even have space to put this is crazy. Because yeah. the figurines just takes... It just takes over just, the house. He just can't stop buying. <laughs> like, he's just... It's an addiction. Stacking. It's an addiction. Yeah, but it gets to a point where, like, he, he oh. don't have no space. Yeah. Actually, no space to... You guys know manga is a very addicting hobby. It is expensive. Expensive. Yeah, so... Yeah, yeah, I, I haven't. I'm gonna look at those later. Oh. I need to change out my battery. Okay, so next thing we have here is Bakuman. This, oh, okay, thanks for helping out, <laughs> helping me rate some series and let me know. So, back to filming with just moi. Really liked how my brother came into the video and helped me with just reacting as well. So, the next thing we have, yeah, is Bakuman. So, this has a box set. Um, I do want to pick this up. Um, this is the same manga as Death Note, but since it's quite text heavy, I'm not too sure if it's worth me picking up. But the next thing he has is Fairy Tail. We ain't looking at the back now. Since my brother has left, I don't know how I'm going to put all these volumes back. Next, we have is Eye Shield. So, this series is complete this is a super out of print series i don't know how he got this but um i don't know how many volumes this series has but it is the whole row of this and it's double stacked so um i don't know how many volumes this series has but it's definitely complete in his collection which is mad so the next thing he has is Yu-Gi-Oh. i'm pretty sure the back is just Yu-Gi-Oh as well let's just yep yeah, more Yu-Gi-Oh if you can tell so we won't look at that Oh, he has this. Oh, more Yu-Gi-Oh. So the next he- thing he has is Sarai. Mashiro Shibata. That sounds so familiar. But um, I-, I don't really know what the series is about. Anyway, so on to the next shelf. So we have Maiko 2010. So wow, the art style is so beautiful. It reminds me of something. I don't know what series I've seen. But this is so beautiful. He has a lot of Maggie, so I'm guessing this is either ongoing series or complete. But I'm telling you, this guy most likely has this complete or ongoing. So, yeah. All of the Berserk volumes that's published in English. Like, he is a big Berserk fan from what I can see. As if he's collecting this and the deluxe edition and he has the vigorine of Berserk, I think he's a fan okay (laughs) next thing we have is uzaki chan wants to hang out this i've actually seen on um i think 
somewhere but I don't know whose collection might be Kate Timms's manga as you know she's a culture gal she she basically has everything we have some Junji Ito like from the looks of it I feel like my my cousin's pretty much a cultured man he does have an all-rounder collection in my opinion he has more shonen and seinen series of course and isekai but um i think it's pretty much all round he has lots of popular series and older series which i love so he has trigon some older series like blood lad oh he has i feel like he does own a lot i think this is his volume one shelf where he just has random volumes of everything so i won't be able to show you everything i don't think but um yeah the next shelf he has is naruto we can expect that to be complete as well wow i oh this is actually wrapped <laughs> the fact that he said that he hasn't read 10 percent of his collection just just blows me away because he doesn't have time because he works full time but um yeah this is such a mad collection i can't believe he's picked so many of these great series up i need to ask how long he's been collecting manga but ever since i've known him he always had manga so um what is this series this is gundam wow this is old man next he has 21st century boys by naoki urasawa now on to the next shelf there's so many shelves so we have full stop hack um let's see oh this is quite thick on this volume i feel like i've seen this series recently don't know why and then we have full metal alchemist another great shonen series that i pretty much need to watch and read we have dragon ball z oh this is no this is just dragon ball this is dragon ball z and then we've got dragon ball super wow oh my goodness he even has orange i can't believe this like, i've been wanting to collect this series it's just currently really hard to get as i feel like they just haven't reprinted it yet so they're pretty much out of stock and i'm just waiting for restock wow he even has volume one of arjun so yeah this is a completed series i do apologize my camera just cut out and i needed to change the battery as i basically used it as it's max today as i've been recording loads just doing vlogging with my family so i'm glad i brought an extra battery as i feel like god just knew that i was gonna film today but we have some other series like lone wolf club but i'm so surprised to see so many like series we even have shaman king wow this is a recent series he has volume one of a silent voice so I'm guessing he does collect a lot of volume ones and see if he enjoys them. Oh, he even has Jujutsu. You like? Okay, this volume is super hard to get right now in the community. If you know, you know. But it looks like he has some Iskai series at the back, if you guys can see. I feel like he hides his culture manga at the back. I'm so sorry if my cousin is watching this. I'm literally diving into your fortress. Um, but yeah, we have Haikyuu. So um, I'm guessing he has all the volumes because this series is complete. It has 42 volumes and um, yeah, that's that's mad to see Haikyuu. Wow, this is a dream to get as well. So next we have is Death Note. This is a completed series. Absolutely love. Personally with Death Note, I prefer the black editions as I feel like they look better on the shelves. But from the looks of this, this is definitely more compact compared to having the black editions but yeah it looks like he has all volumes of assassination classroom as well you guys would have seen in my last hauls i did pick up the box set and i will be taking it with me to uni very soon so i can read it next we have is don't meddle with my daughter wow okay sometimes with these titles i just had to expect it to be isekai and um yeah, that's, that's quite cultured, I can say that. Um, the next thing we have is housing, which my brother saw earlier, which he would, oh, there's a spider. Do you not like that? If you guys know, you know I don't like bugs. But yeah, housing, he has, well, there's 10 volumes. Pretty sure this would be complete. So on to the last two shelves before I go on to the boxes. So he has the Jojo volumes. If you guys know, I do own part three in my collection, the single volumes rather than these ones. I prefer the single ones actually, but these are Jojo's. Wow. Prison School. I don't know much about this series, but I heard that it is quite cultured. There is a bit etchy and some fan service, I believe. I might be wrong. If I am wrong, do correct me down below in the comment section. 
but next he has monster so on my instagram stories you might have catch that he does own volume one of monster which is super hard to get right now i think they have a reprint recently as i see them going back in stock on amazon in the end of this month but uh, yeah yeah that is monster really great series by now cute unisawa then he has neon genesis and wow okay so he has some box sets here so he has one piece so two um box sets of one piece do let me know down below if you know anything of this but um i see a lot of um jojo here as well oh he even has par you'll <laughs> this is actually jokes yeah my cousin is definitely an all-rounder collector because while well, he even has paradise kiss and he has black torch volume one but yeah let's see what he has here so he has love yes i swear that is um this is also oh, not this one this is also um this is a light novel as well but yeah so it looks like he has lots of volume ones here so he has goodnight pim pim fruits basket gobudu and kamui he does says he loves this series by the way um wow the way of the house husband b stars i wonder if he even has excel sheet i need to ask him because how does he keep track of his series i even see black clover at the back yosuba let's see what's at the back of here there's Dr. Stone. There's just so many random volume ones that I'm so surprised to see. So um, I see a few East Kai series. And oh, he even has Parasite. So what is going on? The next thing you see is, I have no idea what this is, but we just move. Um, He has Black Lagoon. And wow, he has so many volumes of Black Lagoon. That's mad. Sorry, um, I do apologise for my reactions as I am quite repetitive with how I react as my vocabulary is very limited, if you can't tell already. But the next thing he has... Oh my... Emma, Geeky Dreams, this is calling for you. 20th Century Boys, all you want. I've been trying to get my hands on this for a while now but it's just so hard to find. But yeah, he does have Pandora Hearts as well. This is literally so hard to get. Um, and it's just so nice to see in this collection. So what is behind? Yeah, there's more Pandora hearts at the back. Next he has is Full Metal Panic. Not too sure what this is about, but there's more vo there's more volumes of this. Looks like he has a lot of Dark Horse volumes as well. Blade of the Mor oh Blade of the Immortal. I've heard of this load. Not gonna lie, oh, it was quite quite dusty. <laughs> we'll blow that away. Um, yeah, oh wow, he has lots of Blade of the Mortal volumes. This is crazy. I know a lot of people will be going mad right now with watching this. Um, so he has a lot of Vinland Saga, 20th Century Boys, Mobile Suit Gundam The Origin. I'm not going to go into detail now because I feel like he even has Message to Adolf. That. Oh, he has World End. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Kate Dunster's manga can appreciate this because this is some culture-ness. But we have Pluto here and some other series that um slime as well. Um Whoa, he's 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 just got everything. What is going on here? He's got solo leveling, he does have volume one upstairs. He even has volume one of Inuyashiki. That is literally one of my favourite animes as well. I would love to collect that, but um we'll see. Money is a bit tight right now, if you guys know. So next he has in the last shelf is um Monster Hunter. And then more Monster Hunter, One Piece, Rosary of Vampire. I do apologize, my butchering, and Claymore. This what is this? That's just Mickey Mouse, but um yeah, he does have is that ping pong i say yes he even has ping pong like this guy has everything like is this a store or what because i feel like this is a store i can take some manga home i feel like but yeah this is his collection right now i am going to move yeah i do apologize if um the volume and the audio sound a bit weird for the last 10 minutes or so but i still hope you guys enjoyed me showing you his whole collection at the back but now we're gonna go into the nitty gritty and look what's on top so let me put you guys down actually um i need to be careful as he's got some some heavy duty stuff here so onto the boxes now looks like he has loads of volumes of the ancient magus bride which these are series that i would love to have in my collection wow he's he's basically got the whole deal yeah he's got the whole deal of the ancient magus bride wow okay he's got more berserk to you'll oh, sorry i keep on saying you're lying you're joking like I'm just so gobsmacked right now, but um, 
he has more volumes of the deluxe editions got volume six and three here so i guess he hasn't added it to his shelves yet um next he has oh these are quite yellow actually if you can tell very very yellow this is gunslinger girl okay hmm okay we got some starcraft ghost academy starcraft more starcraft okay clover on top and then the oh, ghost in the shell wow we wow okay okay now on to the boxes because i need to see what else is going on here in this box he has some series he has basically all the volumes of initial d this is one of my favorite old animes that i used to watch it also has um a taiwanese movie slash cantonese um that has jay chow in it he's the main actor for that um really great movie i really enjoyed it well i'm a girl with it so i'm a bit biased with that he has iron rock jan so not too sure what this is about but i can tell you he's got this complete in his box and then let's see what the next box is i feel like with this video is literally a collection tour slash reactions but yeah this is the next box oh it's quite stiff oh god don't want to break anything so in here he has more my hero academia and next he has a colossal editions which i saw earlier he has freezing he has vanguard is it vanguard yes he has card fight vanguard and freezing and more of vanguard and freezing so that is just this box so now on to the last two boxes that i'm going to tackle before i end this video so wow it looks like he has some cultured manga here so we have overlord that's what i can see we have from the new world wow has a loads of volumes of seven deadly sins which is all wrapped up which you guys know i do have this in my collection but i'm planning to unhaul uh, we have overlord a bunch of overlord what's this oh from the new world still and it looks like just more volumes of seven deadly sins so it looks like that is the box you can tell with my cousin he does collect like me where he collects everything all in one go now on to the final box of his collection let's open this which i'm so surprised to see so he has i am a hero this is such a hard series to collect nowadays and here i'm i'm just being super jealous not gonna lie um this collection is just mad so we have gants more gants i think it's just all gants yeah i think it's all gants and then we have some one punch man volumes here and just gants let's see what's at the bottom one punch man so yeah i'm pretty sure that's what's in this box so pretty easy bunch of one punch man i am a hero and gants so yeah that is all in his boxes and also his bookcases i really hope you guys enjoyed this manga reaction video i feel like it's just been all over the place but i feel like it was fun you know so yeah quickly before i go let's do a quick pan of his collection so so stunning but anyway i hope you guys have a great day and a blessed week and i'll see you guys next week bye Jupiter,